Joe. Wad up wad up. It's your boy Two Butters in the house. Back at it again with another tutorial. Today I'm going to teach you how I'm able to do awesome paintings using only my mouse in Adobe Flash. Here are some examples of what I'm able to do with this technique. Well, let's start. First of all I want to say that to do this, you obviously have to be good at drawing. Even if you are using your mouse, you have to be good at drawing normally. Okay, what you want to do first is a quick sketch of whatever you want to draw to guide you. Then you add some details and it's done. Now it's when it starts becoming interesting. Now you are going to select the line tool. And with this, you will start drawing the figures that you want. At the beginning the lines are going to be straight. But in order to make the curves you just have to click on the line and drag it in the direction you want. Until it looks like you want it to look. When you are done doing all the lines, just use the bucket tool to fill the figure with the colors you want. Then you will have to start adding lights and shadows. Basically just do the same thing as you did for the lines and the you use the bucket to fill it with the color. Once your drawing is finished, one thing you can do to really make it look cool is to delete all the lines. To do that you just have to double click the lines and all of them will be selected. Then you press the delete button and it's done. We can say that this is the most satisfying part of the process. Well, I hope this tutorial helps you. And remember that if you like League of Legends, speed arts, tutorials, and stuff, just subscribe because I will be uploading all those things. Hello everyone, welcome to this new video. And today I will be teaching you how to draw in Flash without using a graphic tablet. Like you can do this with your mouse and it's really simple. We're gonna be using the pen tool and this sub selection tool. Okay, first of all, the pen tool works like this. Like if you click, you can create lines, as you can see. And if you click on one of the lines, you can create another dot. Right? So with this tool, with this selection tool, you can actually move the dot to whatever you want, as you can see right here. And for example, let's say that you want this to be a curve. You have to click on the Alt and then do this. And as you can see, you create a curve right here. So using this technique, you can create like whatever shape you want to do. And actually, the graphic designers and stuff, they use this a lot. So, it's a proven method. Okay, if this seems like too easy or too uh, slow, you can try this other thing that is a little bit more complicated. But you can do this, right? You can go like this and try to do the shapes that you want and stuff this is actually a, a little bit more difficult but once you master it is like simple as you can see you can create the shapes you want and you can fill it in too okay so last of all you can do the same thing if you create like a shape like this you can actually like move the dots or create another one like here and do the exact same thing so yeah I really hope this tutorial helps you and this is a technique that actually 
like the graphic designers use a lot the pen tool and all that stuff so like it's something that people actually do and yeah it's a little bit hard at the beginning but then like when you get the hang of it it becomes easier with a lot of practice so yeah I hope this tutorial helps you and remember that in my channel I have more Photoshop and flash tutorials so if you want to learn more go to my channel and subscribe yeah thank you for watching and I hope it helps you